Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Woodmill Incorporated, where I've been asked the question, what is up with the mushroom? And I'm sitting here like, what are you talking about? And then I noticed somebody saw the mushroom sitting back here. Well, to that person, that's not a mushroom. That is a candle <laughs> that is stuck in the ground. There we go. So... Uh, for the person that was asking, that was absolutely adorable that you thought it was a mushroom. I couldn't figure out what you were talking about, and then you said that was the mushroom that was on my base. And I was like, okay, let's look around. So that's when I found it. Uh, tonight, I want to build some storage units because we got a lot of wood to um, put into different storage bins and stuff like that. Okoza, thank you so much for your sign, dude. I did not realize that you'd, uh, you'd given me a copy. Blink. Oh, that did not. Oh, there we go. Nice. So, um, over here, let's see. Let's see. What's a good spot? I would say let's go ahead and move these, and we will make these part of the bins themselves. Um, rotate, turn, and oh gosh, I don't want to get off the alignment here. All right, let's move this again. Uh, should we? Whoa, that's a really big one. Wait, how did I get the, what? Hold on. What? What is, what is that? You know what? Let's just do this. Destroy. Yep, destroy. We're just going to destroy everything. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Get out of here. Go on. Destroy. And destroy. And that's the cool thing about uh, building inside Woodmill. You can start over, you know? Start from scratch. Uh, I don't want it right on the edge, so we'll go one unit away. Was that one unit? Hold on. Are we able to move one, two? Okay, so. Wow. It looks like we've got a point two system going on here. That doesn't sound right. Okay, hold on. So that's one unit right there. And that'll be for the edge. I want to come all over here, all the way up. That'll be that one wow I really can't see it's like super dark hold on let me go and grab a light source here yoink grab this I'll just drag it over here whoa 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 why are you not dragging okay that's good that's good right there that way we can see a little bit while we work in the dark do a little whistle while we work. There we go. And hold on. Why is that? Okay. Okay. Calm down there. Blink. All the way up. All the way up. There we go. And all the way out. Just like that. Nice. And now we should be able to do the same right here. That doesn't... That don't compute. Wait. Hold on right there <laughs> okay uh, I might need to grab these and get these out of the way hold on can I can I grab these I cannot grab these while building that's okay it should only be a small percentage yeah five percent that's fine Let's hit B and four get rid of that oh no 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 I don't I don't want to chop that I want to move that thank you move this out of the way and this will be this will be like storage bin number one and I need to move this slightly closer, don't I? Hello, Akoza, what's up, buddy? All right, so let's go a little bit closer by like 0.2 units. Oh, by the way, if you happen to be here on my channel because of PAX, like you met me at PAX, comment down below. Let me know where I met you and like what, what the whole situation was because I had a lot of subscribers, but nobody was talking. Uh, what? Oh, S. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's uh, that's the statue, the David statue. Thanks. All right, how many units does this need? That's only 15%, wow. Okay, 15, 30. And I, I figure I just build out of the, uh, the oak that's around here. It's only 38%, wow. 
Oh, the power to build would, would, like, that used to be so amazing. But I like that it's actually, it's going to take some time and some effort to throw into building stuff that this is this big. I've got a lot of people chatting. But uh, I am back from PAX, PAX West, or PAX West, if you know the joke. Um, lots of people I met out there, lots of fun I had. And I took fifth place in the Brawlhalla competition. I will be putting up um, a small montage to that game and to the, the competition. So you will be able to see that very shortly, very soon. But I want to edit. I've got to do some editing. Um, and yes, I do edit the, uh, the cosplay video and the... Wow, why is that like smacking against something. There's something invisible there. Do you guys see that? What is that? Crazy. Hold on. Let's uh let's back this car up a little bit. There we go. See if it was something invisible. No, it's actually colliding against something in the back of the car. See that? Okay. Okay, come on. Let's just do our best here. And good. Hi. Lucas! Another one of the developers. Hey, buddy. What's going on? How are you? How are you today? <clears throat> I don't think that one's touching. 28%, 33%. That's okay. We can take these little pieces. It won't be much, but it'll help. 35. <laughs> Are you gonna give me straight bamboo walls? There we go. 38. Now, if you guys don't remember my original video on like how to calculate um, percentages, I highly suggest going back and watching some of those because it will work here as well. There is a percentage. Whoa. Oh, no! I did the little one. Destroy that one. There we go. It will do percentages based on the amount of uh, wood that you have in there. So if you have 50% of something and 51% of something else, that 51% will actually take the majority and turn it into what you... Uh, what you wanted. So, uh, I hope everybody had a lot of fun. Um, I know I didn't release a video on Monday or Tuesday. What is today? Today is Wednesday, so uh, I do apologize, but at the same time, it was a well-deserved, well-needed break away from recording, away from the world, just having fun. And, you know, I missed my family big time. I got to go out and see the Seattle Space Needle while I was out there, and I was so depressed <laughs> because my family was not there with me. It was it was sad. It was super sad. But back home, back with my family, and loving it. So uh, I will be writing an article for um, PC Magazine pcmag.com um, it's going to be Roblox based so how to build a game in Roblox uh, there's an old article written by David I'll be uh, redoing that one for him there's a secondary article but I don't remember if it's by David or not it might be somebody else but I'm going to be writing for uh, PC Magazine which is it's super exciting you know uh, the second edition book is done, so all I gotta do is turn that in. Uh, I will probably do that tomorrow. Was probably supposed to do it today, but it's okay. It's, uh, what? That's awesome. In fact, I think by contract it was supposed to be due today, but, um, my publisher, she has access to the shared drive, so if there was any problems, she'd contact me and let me know. Um, I've got a lot of new 
uh, screenshot updates, a lot of new code fixes, a lot of a lot of stuff that uh, the first book just didn't have. And I didn't realize this, but there's an entire section that I had over filtering enabled and like securing your your uh, your game, your workspace that I just I didn't even need. So I took that entire section out. Um, I left a little snippet in there on what to do for filtering enabled or like what it used to be but basically it's it's a pointless thing filtering and enabled is for all roblox games now so if you don't have filtering enabled on tell me how you did it because it's impossible to get rid of hi <clears throat> excuse me Oh, an entire episode, and we're going to build one bin. That's awesome. Hey, it's Hunter. Hi, Hunter. Hi, Fairy. Hi, Lucas. Here, um, I will grant you guys access to everything because I'm not afraid. Oh, Morgs is here too. Morgs, you have access to everything. Lucas, uh, you have access to everything. Michelle, I don't know you. Sorry. Hunter, you have access to everything. As chick, I know you. You have access to everything. Headless fairy, you have access to everything. And red guy 16, you have access to everything. So, Michelle, pop pop on I can't even say it right. So, I'm just going to leave you as the only person who doesn't have access, which is is going to be kind of weird. Oh, wow, oh, wow. Oh. People are talking. Ah. <laughs> Scary face. Just kidding. There is no face. <laughs> All right. There's 51%. Oh, yeah. Where, where were we at? Oh, no. We were at 41%. So that's about 10 units. So wait, does this wall take 100 units just to build? Oh, I might go less than that on the next one. Just saying. I guess if it's five units by five units, that'd be five times five, which is only 25 units. So is this 10 by 10, 10 units by 10 units? I could measure that real quick. Uh, let's do that. Let's take a cube. We're gonna go plus. We're gonna go right here. One, two, three, four. Are these evenly spaced? I can't tell. Six, seven, eight, nine, whoa, and ten. That sounded important. Give me one second. Nope, wasn't important. Somebody wanted to know about my extended car's warranty. Eleven. 12. 12 by 12. That's 144. Okay, Google. What's 12 times 12? 12 times 12 is 144. So it takes 144 units to fill a big wall like this. And that is that is a lot of wall. So um, let's see. Destroy. Destroy, destroy. We're not gonna make the next one quite that big. I mean, I, I think it's ridiculous that it needs to be that big. We'll, we'll make it five up and 12 across. That, that would be a more sensible option, I think. Oh gosh, please tell me I'm not small enough that I can't reach that top one, please. Okay, I was able to get it. There we go. Okay, so we're 67, 71, oh, oh, still 71, 75, Ugh, taking forever, 79, here, oh, I need the big one, let's put the big one in there, oh, come on, oh, please, please, 84, 84, 89, 93, 
Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Did it fall? I think it fell. 97! Oh my god. <laughs> and done. Holy cow, that took forever. Yeah, we're, we're not doing that again. Um, here, I need to move this. Move this structure. Uh, we will rotate, turn. Uh, turn, rotate, turn. There we go. We'll just stick it up here on top. Just get it, just to get it out of the way. And then uh, we can get some conveyor belts out of the way as well. One over here and one over here. <laughs> it's funny that it turned on me. That's fine. Um, these are my original axes as well. So let's put these down over here. Um, and like I said, I'm not going as big as I did in that last one. Let's do cylinder shape. And we're going to go right here. By the way, I could be so much more creative with this. And I, I encourage you, if you're going to build storage units like this, uh, one, two, three, four, five, no, wait. That's not a full, that's two units. One, two, yeah, two, three, four. So wait, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so that's ten wide and one, oh, sorry, two. Three, four, five, tall. Just like that. So, that's good. And now, we should be able to go right here. We're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 and then just make it the same height just like that so notice how it's a little bit shorter on that end just by like two units maybe maybe one and a, one and a half units maybe but that's what I want so okay let's see how well this gets put together 5 by 10 should only be what 50 50 units of wood Hi, hi, hi. Hi, code. Or maybe it said hi, dad. <laughs> oh, Roblox filtering. All right. Mm, I don't want to use those. I want to use those as storage. Actually, you know what? We're going to put the ash trees in here. This will be the ash tree storage. Okay. So, there's ash tree. Uh, I need more oaky trees. Not elmy trees, oaky trees. Don't want to use that, it's cheating. <laughs> okay. Four, five. How's the sound going? Is the, is the desktop audio too loud? I mean, I'm looking at it and it looks massive. Oh gosh. Come on, flip. Flip. Boom. Okay. This, hold up. Is this an elm tree? I think this is an elm. Hi guys. <laughs> oh man. That is an elm tree, isn't it? Dang it. Well, maybe an elm's what I needed. No! <gasps> Sorry. I'll go back to this one. <laughs> Although I don't I don't think anybody cares that I've got the golden axe, but again, I want to be a player. Don't want to be um, considered cheating. Technically, it's not cheating. I'm, I'm a developer. I can I can do this if I wanted to, but I still don't find it fair. You know, 
if you guys can't have access to it, then I shouldn't have access to it either. Oh, come on. No, get in there. You silly. You goose. Okay. All right, back to the pink axe. Uh, do, 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 do. <laughs> it's 20 minutes. 20 minutes into the video and you're still watching. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, if you guys don't know the story of Bowser, he was uh, one of the con competition people. And I'm calling my lawyer. <laughs> he was one of the, uh, the people that fought in Brawlhalla with me. And... I've got a story for you. Like, I don't know if he's going to tell his story on his side, but... Oh, dang. Seriously. Like, it is the story of stories. It is something to be admired. Now, let's check real quick. Is this the same wood? This is not the same wood. I do not want to do that. So... Put that back over here. Um, since we've already got it here, I'm, I might as well... Should I, should I pause it for the boring part? And just so you know, I didn't pause it because I wanted to use the golden axe. I know there's somebody in the comments being like, Oh, just paused it so he could use the gold axe. I didn't. Maybe we should be building out of the elm trees because those things, like, I got a lot of wood from that one tree. Just saying. Like, that's a that's a lot of building material. You can't, you can't cough at that. All right, hold on. Fifty-nine percent. Let's uh, let's go one third of this and see if that helps us complete a wall. Mm. Mm. Hold on one second for me. Okay, I th think I chopped that. There we go. Oh, it's only eighty-eight percent. Wow. So since it's fifty-nine, we're adding that for eighty-eight percent. half of this that's a lot of units of wood actually yeah 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 yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll do half of this and if it's not enough we'll we'll add that little bit over there okay 99 percent 99 percent that is that is ridiculous okay hold on can we chop this one somehow get this little piece off here Come on, there you go. Boom. Yes. Nice. Now, let's just go ahead and fill this one in. Hopefully, 42, 67. Oh, come on. Actually, if we just take these back out. 42, 67. If this... Hold on. We'll chop this in half and see how much this is. Hopefully if it's over 50%, then we should only be able to use two of them, right? Does that sound right? I don't, I don't, I don't know. 50 and 50 makes 100%, right? Yeah, it does. Boom. Nice. <sighs> okay. So that's going to look a little janky, but that's okay. We're, we're going to switch to that material. Anyway, all right, here we go. You guys dancing on my signs back there. And we can just use these as kind of a guide. Well, I gotta count those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cool, 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 cool. It looks, it looks the same. So, um, I'm just going to, I'm gonna go with it. I'm gonna roll with it. He rolls. Boom. Um, destroy these. They, they were not very sensible either. <clears throat> They're the little wedges for my, uh, is that the same size? Hold on, let's do a move structure. Place it right on top here. 
No. How did that turn out one unit longer? That's okay. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to move it one unit this way. There we go. Then that way it fills in the gap. Yay. And then I should be able to come back over here, do a cube, hit plus, and right here, up, and come over to here. Uh, looks good to me. Oh, I hit B. Dang it. That's the wrong, wrong button. I needed to hit E, not B. Right there. Let's go up to here. to here. Good. E. Got it. Nice. Now, we will chop one of these in half. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what happened? Uh, not E. Four. There we go. Chop one of these in half. Hopefully it'll be enough for an entire wall. Actually, why are we, why are we messing with it? Why are we even chopping? Boom. Wall. Done. Okay. Let's do, let's do this. I have an idea. So what if I were to just grab right here, go up to here, come across to here, done. Do it again. Here, across to here, down to here. Oh, did it go in the floor? No, done. And here, up to here. Uh oh, burp, burp. why is it? Off by you. Oh, it's not. It's not. It's even. It's even. There we go. Just across to there. And E for done. Okay. So now hit B and get rid of our blueprint. One. Two. And three. Look at that. Bam. Now, if we take and move structures out. We're just going to move these over here. <laughs> Look at the speed build going on. Right? Right? Am I right? Turn, rotate. Whoa. That did not rotate the way I thought it was going to. There we go. Go here. Boom. Move structure. Rotate. What in the world? Uh, that is not rotating the way that I thought it would. Can't build there. Can't sit here. Seat's taken. Oh, it changed. Nice. There we go. So, uh, 28. That's uh, just under our time. I think... These should fit in here nicely. So let's go ahead and start sorting a little bit. Have wood structures for us. Wood storage. I like that we did the elm. I'm, I'm glad we did that. That was a good decision. Ugh, what are all these messages? People, hold on. Oh, I just got new comments on one of my other woodmill videos. Thank you. <clears throat> I like the comments that are well thought through and inspirational. Just good in nature. You know, I, I love those kind of comments. If you want to comment like that all day long, you go for it. I am 100% for an inspirational quote of some kind or just a feel good, you know, like Code, I was having a really bad day and your video helped me out of it. Stuff like that. Thank you. I appreciate that. I never considered myself a motivational speaker. You know, I never thought of myself in that manner or that way, but that's what my channel has become. I mean, that's where I'm heading and why fight it? You know, I like what I do. Just saying. Come on, get in there. Get in there. There you go. What a good little tree. Uh oh, it's stuck. It's broken. Oh no, the world's coming to an end. Oh, there it is. Okay. 
And that one goes in here as well, right? Yeah, just like that. Good deal. All right, guys. Everybody posing? Everybody posing for the picture? There we go. And cheese. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Woodmill Incorporated. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. I love you for that. Have a great night or a great day. Whatever it is to you, make sure you make it great, okay? And don't take that the wrong way. You're going to have bad days. It's going to happen just like you're gonna have good days. But I want you to understand that being happy or being sad, it's not a permanent state, okay? So as much as you wanna say, have a great day all the time with a big happy face, it doesn't happen. And we understand that. Everybody on the internet should understand that, okay? For your mental health and for ours, just relax. Take some time, take a break, stay calm, you know, don't, don't get mad about something. Don't get sad about something. Don't get overly happy or excited about something. Just take a second for yourself. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you soon. Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.